us. The government we want to do requires sacrifice of all of us. We must build a better Nigeria. We can't continue the way it is today. Very true. A productive Nigeria. One Nigeria where everyone and each of you will be proud to hold your green pass. Commission and Nigerian embassies will deal with it. Yes. 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 Where you are treated as the second citizen in the world. Yes. We will come to this world and we will show that Nigeria is a great country. Thank yes. 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 you and God bless all of you. He, he was fearless today and, and it was good to see and I'm taking that, I'm encouraged by that, I'm encouraged by you know his fearless nature, his show of strength, the boldness um, to stand and declare because let's not forget he's not, um, it's not as though he's a stranger to politics. Um, I'm Dr. Isia Kushitwa Mustafa Gumbi uh, from the University of Plymouth and uh, Global Banking School in London, Stratford. I've taken one key team from him. He has a good policy, he has a good strategy, and is incorruptible. And if he's been elected, Mr. His Excellency Peter Obi, he's a good guy. Everything is speaking about Nigeria, Nigeria, understand, but can he get the right people? to work with him so that we won't do the same thing because it's not, it's not just talking how will it happen? I feel like God will help Nigeria he has policy, he has program, he has a vision and he has a, he has a love of the country but particularly because he will declare war on education sector and that's very good and, uh, we hope May 29, uh, 2023, uh, it will be, be announced as a president and commander in chief of the armed forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. I saw in him today a true commander in chief, someone who will lead from the front. <laughs> Awesome, beautiful, beautiful response to the questions. We look forward to him. Vote Peter Obi.